Ask Reddit by, deleted. What show will you never get tired of rewatching? Twilight Zone. You're traveling through another dimension, a dimension not only of sight and sound but of mind. A journey into a wondrous land whose boundaries are that of imagination. That's a signpost up ahead, your next stop, the Twilight Zone. Whose line is it anyway? I watched it a lot as a kid years ago when it was running on TV. Then recently discovered it again on HBO Max, they had literally every episode. I binged it for months and months and months lol. I couldn't stop, it was so funny and addicting, even the newer CW version. Nothing beats the episode where Wayne and Wanny Morris sing a boys to men style duet about getting your tires changed, it was perfect, and Wayne is an incredibly good singer. What we do in the shadows. This show it's my best friend, my pal. My homeboy, my rotten soldier, my sweet cheese, my good time boy. It crowd. Peter File. Band of brothers. Can't get get enough of Sybil getting his. King of the hill. Are you gay? No I sell propane. Malcolm in the middle. Started watching this again a little while ago. My brother and I watched it when it originally aired. Watching it as an adult you see it completely differently. It holds up. Relatable and funny. X-Files. Deleted. Star Trek. The Next Generation. It is possible to commit no mistakes and still lose. That is not a weakness. That is life. Gravity Falls I find new things every time and it's also just a darn good time, and nostalgic. I realized last week it was already a decade old. WTF. Arrested Development, Seasons 1-3. I love all the seasons of AD equally. Sometime later. I don't care for the fourth season. Stargate. SG-1 Colonel O'Neill what the hell are you doing? In the middle of my backswing 30 Rock Kenneth I don't vote Republican or Democrat Choosing is a sin So I always just write in the Lord's name Jack That's Republican We count those Science was my most favorite subject Especially the Old Testament as someone who grew up in a conservative homeschooling Bible Belt family, every Kenneth line is gold. It's always sunny in Philadelphia. Alright, where do I put my feet? House MD. Everybody lies. The good place. Ugh the ending is so good and satisfying. Michael Schur is fantastic and I love all the shows he's been a writer in. The Good Place is his baby and is definitely has the best writing emo. South Park. Simpsons. First 10 seasons. Firefly. Shiny. Scrubs. This comment post has been deleted as an act of protest to Reddit killing third party apps such as Apollo. HTTPS colon slash slash old dot reddit dot com slash r slash apollope slash comments slash 144F6XM slash Apollo underscore will underscore close underscore down underscore on underscore June underscore 30th underscore edits slash closed bracket dot The Sopranos The intervention with Chris C never ceases to make me chuckle I said my piece Chrissy. Futurama. Space, it seems to go on and on forever, but then you get to the end and a gorilla starts throwing barrels at you. And then I'm hooked, again. Water, earth, fire, air. Long ago, the four nations lived together in harmony. Bob's Burgers. 
I just started watching this of a friend's recommendation and it's way I, I, I funnier than I ever thought it would be. Fringe. I love Fringe. Just started watching it again on Prime. Community. Try and a bed in the moon morning. Shit's Creek. Absolutely. I was putting a quiche together the other day and burst out laughing when I added grated cheese to my egg mixture. You fold it in David. I can't be any more clear than that. Adventure Time. It holds a nostalgia for the easier seeming times of the 2010s. Its quirky far out humor and surprising philosophies that grew with its audience make it compelling throughout varied age groups. I prefer to rewatch the third season out of all but sometimes I shuffle the entire series. I watched it as an adult and its variety of idyllic atmosphere combined with some occasional, light speculative fiction is something I can return to forever. Breaking Bad and Better Call Saul. It seems every time I rewatch it, I uncover a new secret I didn't realize before. A co-worker and I have this sort of running joke that goes like this. Well, I just finished rewatching Breaking Bad, so now I have to rewatch El Camino. Now that I finished El Camino, I guess I should rewatch Better Call Saul. Now that I finished my Better Call Saul rewatch, might as well restart Breaking Bad. Frazier. Sherry, Niles. SpongeBob, but the classics only.